What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Traven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so it's finally nighttime around here, and uh, well, let's see what we got. In our last episode, we managed to get ourselves our very first badge, the Zephyr Badge. Look at that, it's spinning around, looking all awesome and all that stuff. And now it is finally time to move on ahead and... Uh, well, just challenge the whole world. Not only that, but we also got ourselves a Pokemon egg. As you can see, it's the very first Pokemon egg that we've gotten in this whole in this whole walkthrough. And it, clearly, we still need a little bit of time to actually get this thing to hatch. So, got wilds away. Wilds and wilds and wilds away. So, let's move on right here. We've already taken... We've already beaten everybody right here. Now it is finally time to move on to the next route. I don't remember what route it was called. Luckily, it will it will show us right here. Before before anything, fruit bearing tree. We got the paralyzed cure or the par paralysis cure uh, berry or paralyzed cure berry. I don't know whatever you like. You guys like to call it. So as you can see, we're in route 32. Now there are two different kinds of places that you can go to right here. Now if you go right here, the ruins of Alf. You got the east entrance right here. We will be visiting that place later on. Right now, I would like to continue our adventure down to Route 22 because there's a lot of stuff that we have to cover. Plus, there is something that we need to get right around here too. Route 32, Violet City to Azalea Town. And as you can see, if you don't have a badge, this guy won't let you pass. But if you do, look at that, he lets us go through. But now talk to him and he says, you have some good Pokemon there. It must be from training you you gave them around Violet City. The training at the gym must have uh, been especially helpful. As a souvenir of Violet City, take this. It increases the power of grass type po of grass type moves. He gives us the Miracle Seed, and I don't think I have a grass type Pokemon. He's like your experience of Violet City should be useful for your journey. Okay, alrighty. So. Here we are in the nighttime. Now we will be seeing some Pokemon that only appear in the nighttime. And uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Nope, I ain't got no Pokeballs. I ain't got no Pokeballs. So I gotta go back. I gotta go back. I really do, cause uh, I may have spoiled it right here. Yeah, I'm gonna capture myself another Pokemon, and it only appears at night. And uh, we need some Pokeballs for that stuff. But luckily. We want a few uh, matches, so that gives us a chance to get, you know, five good Pokeballs. So, we're broke again. Um, you know what? Let's not be broke. Let's sell some stuff. Um, we don't need this. <laughs> so, we're back at $500, and uh, we got a few berries here and there. Uh, okay, so that's it. That's pretty much it right there. So... I already spoiled it, we will be finding a Pokemon. It only appears at night right here. And uh, here we are back at Route tw uh, 32. Got the Miracle Seed and all that stuff, and here we got some patchy grasses. Now, I did tell you that you can find some Hoot Hoots around here at night. That is not one of the Pokemon that we wanted to capture, but yeah, that's one of the Pokemon you can capture. Also, Zubat can appear right here. They get out of their caves, feeling good about themselves. And look at that, Teddy's right here. And I don't want to mess with you right now. Um, you know what? I should go with Toxic Batman right here because I don't want to make this Pokemon faint right away. But I do want to battle this guy. It's like, I haven't seen you around here before. So, you think you're pretty tough? Mother lover, I am tough. I am very, very, very tough. So here we have another Pokemon trainer, Youngster Albert. And he's coming out with his Rattata. Okay, Radita, bring it. Let's go. Now, of course, Toxic Batman has a uh, leech life. It, it, it's gonna be a while before it starts learning some new moves right here, but hopefully, it takes this Pokemon out right here. And uh, that that took five HP right there. Five HP right now is a lot, a lot of HP. But we do have a uh, we do have leech life, so we 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 like we take some, we lose some, that kind of stuff. There we go again. And that took a lot. That's a critical hit. It's a good one. And, uh, will you stop tail whipping me, you jerk? Here we go. Another leech life. Come on, Toxic Batman. Oh, come on. And that, well, you should have hit me while you still could, man. But I'm going to leech your life because I can. And it's a freaking awesome way. Look at that. Toxic Batman won a battle by itself. 
and an almost game of level, I guess. So it's coming out with the Zubats. So let's switch it up to Teddy right here. It's been a while since I've seen Teddy. Teddy Ursa. I was gonna call it Ted, but it, Teddy, pretty cool. Pretty good stuff right here. So we go scratch attack. Does it go? No, it doesn't go all the way. And that leech life is coming back to bite me in the you know what. Not a lot, but it's gonna bite me in the you know what. Here we go again with another scratch attack. Teddy wins this one. Look at that. Look at that. So we win. That's right. Feeling dang good about that. Okay, so let's go ahead and try and find that Pokemon that, we, that supposedly we're gonna be going to capturing or something like that. And would you look at that? Wooper. So yes guys, the next Pokemon on the list that will be on my team is Wooper. Now, why Wooper and not Gyarados? Now I won't be getting Gyarados till way, way, way later on. But Wooper is a very, very awesome Pokemon. For me, it's one of my favorite Johto Pokemon because it's both a water and ground type Pokemon. The best of both worlds. It will not be affected by electricity, only grass types. And uh you know, it's very bulky once it evolves into a, a Quagsire. Very, very bulky. And, you know, I kind of wanted to try something new right here. So, Wooper, I'm going to try and capture you. You little, you little bastard. And he's going with that Tail Whip right here. Hmm. Please no critical hits. Please no critical hits. If you critical hit him, I swear to God. I'm going to go... There we go. Okay. All right. So that's a good one. Yeah, why did they Tail Whip me? Okay. Go to that Pokeball. Got five of those things. Here we go. Stay in that Pokeball, Wooper. You know you want to come with me. It is your destiny. And there it is, guys. Our fourth Pokemon on our team, Wooper, the water Pokemon. Here we have the water fish. A mucus membrane covers its body. Touching its what? Its bare-handed will cause a will cause a sh shooting pain. Okay, so it's kind of poisonous. Wow. Don't even know how to read this stuff. I really need to learn how to read. Don't you guys agree? So we're gonna call him something right here. We're gonna call him something. What should we call a Wooper that will evolve into a Quagsire? Wooper to Quagsire. Hmm, what's a good name? What is a very, 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 very good name? I can't name him Hydra. That's that's Gyarados's nickname right there. Hmm. Lexi. You know what? I got something for you. This, this reminds me of the the, uh, the anime. I'm going to name him this. I'm going to name him Lucky. Because if you guys don't remember, in the Gold and, Sil Gold and Silver series of the Pokemon, Pokemon anime series, Quagsire, if it catches a round or like a sphere, a sphere item, like a ball or something like that, and it throws it over a waterfall, you will have good luck for a full year. So that's why I am going to call him Lucky. Because eventually he's going to evolve into a Quagsire. So, let's go ahead and take a look at our new Pokemon named Lucky. Look at that. Lucky. Water and ground type Pokemon. You know for a fact this is going to be a very good Pokemon right here. And I did not check its stats. So let's go back to that stat right here. So it has balanced stats right here. Both attack and defense is good. Speed's a little low. But you know what? Eventually it will be one of the best Pokemon we got. And I'm going to use a potion on this guy because we're going to be using him. We're going to try and level him up right here. And uh, okay, let's switch him up right here. So we got Teddy, Cinder, Batman. Talks of Batman. And uh, this chick right here. She's like, uh-uh, yeah, uh, I know. Pardon? Battle? I'm on the phone! Oh, alright. Well, let's make it fast. So... <coughs> Did not mean to cough. God, this sickness is killing me right here. So here we go, Picnicker Liz. And she's coming out with her Nidoran female. Okay, Lucky. Let's do this. Trial run right here, and there's that scratch attack. Takes a lot. Oh god, so water gun. Come on, work. Work, oh god. Okay, so we gotta switch it out. There was no way that uh, that Lucky was gonna do something, like was gonna win right off the bat right here. So here we go with Cinder. And luckily for us, Nidoran female does not know any kind of poison type moves. Or doesn't have those effects that, you know, we've been worrying about. So we go, Ember attack, and it's burned. First person that got burned. And uh, buh bye you got burned. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I love those experience points. So Picnic or Liz is like, uh, okay, I've got to relieve uh, some anger. I'm not going to talk to you because you're going to give me your phone number. I really don't want to get your phone number here. There's a lot of people that's been bugging me as of lately. And here we have another Zubat. Okay. Probably should have captured a Zubat right here. You know what? I have to battle him. I gots to. I gots to because, you know, my, my lucky has gots to be at a good level. It's gots to. And there's that leech life attack. Ooh. Doesn't really do much. Alright, scratch attack. Be physical. Be a man. And it became a man. Mazeltov. And uh, Lucky grew to level 5. Good, good stuff. Good stuff. Alrighty. Anything to help out my Pokemon right here. And here's an item, and that is a Repel. We could use that right now, but that would be a total waste right now. So, I think I should battle that guy. Yeah, I'm going to battle that guy. Alright, bring it on. He's like, that glance, it's intriguing. Wow, it's not like I haven't heard that before. Where have I heard that before? Huh, his name is Roland. The Kanto region, and this guy has a Nidoran male, so this guy could have a poison type attack. So, mm, let's go to Toxic Batman right here, because poison type attacks don't affect poison type Pokemon. Am I right? I think I'm right. So there's that horn attack. Takes a nice chunk, but here's the leech life. And I gotta make it quick right here because... Oh god. Yeah, that wasn't very effective. That's not gonna... Oh god. Oh god. Okay, so... the That wasn't gonna work out at all. So let's go back to Cinder. Hmm. Let's do this. And that tackle attack does not work. So here we go. Ember attack. Hopefully for the win. Come on. Oh my god, almost beats him right there, and... Wow, you're really gonna lower my defense when really I, I have a clear opening right now. Why would you do that? I don't know. So here's more experience points for everybody, and we defeat Roland. Hmm, this is disappointing. It should be disappointing, homeboy. Okay, so let's go right here. And there will be some fishermen right around here. I'm hoping that they do have like Magikarp or something. This guy is like, I got freshly caught Pokemon. Good. Tells me that you're not gonna be good at all. So here he has two Pokemon, and one of them is Poliwag. Oh god. Oh jeez. Gotta be careful for this Pokemon. It does have a tendency to put Pokemon to sleep. So Teddy, let's do this. And uh, like I said before, it tends to do that, and uh, that Poliwag is faster than us, and it's going to continue being faster than us just because of that, that whole bubble attack. Oh yeah. Come on, finish him off. Stop hitting me with bubble. Stop hitting me with your bubbles. And there we go. Say goodbye to Poliswag. I mean, Poliwag. It's a pretty good name, Poliswag. Probably should have gotten the Poliwag. I don't know. Let's go to Toxic Batman. He needs to grow levels. He needs to, like, he's close to evolving. Like, 12 levels, maybe? Who knows? So here we go with Toxic Batman. Leech life. And that bubble attack, it's just, oh god. How am I not faster than this Poliswag? I don't know. Come on, finish him off. Ugh. At this point, I'm probably gonna have to use my other move, and that does not help at all. Jesus, okay, so I'm gonna continue getting hit right here. Pelted with bubbles. Come on. Do not oh god. Yeah, I, this is not worth it. I am going to be switching to Teddy because Cinder is weak against water type Pokemon right here. Alright, let's do this. That bubble attack is gonna be the death of me. I probably should have uh Probably should have packed a little bit more. Here we go. And almost defeated. Let's go with that lick attack and oh my god. If it would have got me with that If it would have got me with that uh, hypnosis, I would have been super angry. And look at that. Toxic Batman finally grows to level eleven after like three or four episodes. And he's like, splash? Yeah, splash, buddy. 
Okay, so let's uh, well, let's wake up a Pokemon right here. Huh. So I don't have the I don't have the item necessary for that. So yeah, that that ain't gonna happen for a while. It, it it's not going to happen. But I can heal it. I can heal it. That way it won't it won't fit while battling. So here we go. Whoa! You made me lose that fish. Okay, so you have to battle me, right? Probably. Okay, so here we have another fisher, and his name is Justin. And yes, he came out with his Magikarp. Okay, okay, so this should be easy, I guess. Oh my god, I'm getting hit with that splash attack. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hmm. Yeah, I probably should have healed my Pokemon. Probably should have healed my Pokemon way before. This would have been an easy battle for uh, for Toxic Batman, but nope, 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 nope. Come on, let's go, Lucky. Come on, Lucky, finish him off. And uh, that splash attack is just like it's hurting. It is hurting me like hell. I'm like I'm feeling it. Every drip of splash. Just hitting me! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm like I, I I seriously I'm gonna die just because of this! Oh my god! Jesus! Why 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 not a uh, critical hit? Critical hit with a splash attack! Look at that! Nothing happened. Of course I'm being a little sarcastic right now. And uh, Jesus! This this magic carp is uh he's a survivor. He is a survivor, and he will not die. And there we go. Bye bye. All right, Lucky. And he's not lucky enough to get a lot more points, but he's, yeah, we got more Magic Card right here. So, I'm gonna go with Toxic Batman right here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and wake him up right here. And uh, it's gonna be a while. I know it's gonna be a while, but it will help me. Come on, wake up. Wake up. That splash attack better do something. Like just put water in your eyes or. I don't think Zubat has has eyes, right? Does it have eyes? Comment down below. Come on. Come on, Toxic Batman. Wake up. You can do this. The nation of Zubats believe in you. Come on, wake up. Come on. Why no you why don't you wake up? Come on. You can do it. And he's woken. And there we go. There's that there's that supersonic we've been waiting for. And uh, he is confused. Confused as no, no other. And he is still hitting me with that splash attack. Okay, so. We only got four leech life attacks. Not really gonna do us a lot. Okay, so. Shoot. Okay, there we go. That's, that can help us out just a little bit. But if we're. We, yeah, we don't have an ether. We don't have nothing. He better hurt himself again on the confusion. Come on. You can do it. He hurt himself. Okay. That leaves us with one leech life. It really doesn't matter anyways. So there we go. Magikarp. Defeated by Toxic Batman. Not a lot of experience points. Okay, you know what? Let's go to Teddy. Let's finish this guy off. <coughs> Man, I am coughing up a lung right here. Why is that? I don't know. Here we go. Scratch attack. Oh, so this Pokemon knows how to tackle. Okay. The lucky one is Teddy. Come on. You have to win. It is your destiny, you teddy bear. And that was a critical hit. That was a good one. Why won't you faint? Alrighty. There we go. Another guy defeated. And... Again, a magic card. Why do you just capture magic card? Seriously, there's other there, there are other uh, water type Pokemon in the sea, and you choose to capture magic card. Why? I don't know. Tackle attack, and that doesn't end them, but this splash will. Will it? I don't know. There we go. Say goodbye. 
And that that is the end of this 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 guy right here. Wow, you suck, man. You really do. So my mom just called because I earned a bunch of money. He's like, "Hi, Draven. How are you? I found a useful sh uh, item shopping, so I bought it with your money. Sorry, it's in your PC. You'll like it." Yeah, she'll do that from time to time. Thank you, mom. Thank you. Okay, so I think we got one more guy right here. Yeah, might as well put Lucky in. So let's do this. I'm really good at both fishing and Pokemon. I'm not about to lose to any kid. Okay, all right. Let's do this. Bring it on. So here we have Fisher Ralph. What do you have? Oh, he has a Goldeen, a pretty good Pokemon. Thank you. Something other than freaking uh, Magikarp. Thank you, Arceus. Now I'm gonna switch out, go to Teddy. Because I don't need this mess. I really don't. So here we are. Teddy. And there's that peck attack that we... Oh, wow. That was a that was a doozy of a hit right there. That was a critical hit, right? And... Uh... Oh, wow. Okay. We're going to paralyze you first. We're going to get to you before you get to us. So there's that lick attack. And he's paralyzed. Good job. All right. So this makes our job a little bit easier. Now that we're technically faster against this guy. And, uh... The least you can do is just tail whip me, but it's not gonna do much. There we go. Feeling it. I'm, I'm loving it. And look at that. Lucky grows to level 7. And, uh, Teddy almost grows to level right there, which is good, I guess. <laughs> I tried to rush things. You tried. You really did. Okay, so, moving on forward. I think we're almost done with this, but I think we're missing a trainer here. I think it's that guy. But there's an item right there too, right? Plus a Pokemon. Don't forget about the Pokemon. And uh, here we have a Bell Sprout. Did not know that they were they they also came out at night. It's kind of fun. It's kind of awesome. And I cannot escape. Oh no 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 no! You asshole, Bell Sprout. Ah. Uh, okay. Oh, I'm gonna have my way with you right here. I am going to have my way with you. Gonna destroy you. Oh my god. Well, that was my fault right there. That was all my fault right there. So, before I can get that item, I'm gonna have to go back to the Pokemon Center. So, oh god, I really didn't want to do this. Travel all the way back. I mean, I know that we're close to, closer to a Pokemon Center, but there's the risk of battling that young man that was down there. And I kind of want to just save him for for lucky. I really do. <sighs> bonehead move. Bonehead move. I'm gonna destroy you right here. I'm gonna grow a level. I really am because I'm annoyed. Bye bye Say bye bye And look at that. Teddy grows to level 13. Awesome! Alright. Okay. You know what? Since it's nighttime, let's go right ahead and uh, switch it to to Toxic Batman. See if uh, Toxic Batman does anything. Actually... I'm gonna skip out on this, so I'll be back in just a little. Okay, so off screen, healed my Pokemon, and uh, you know I checked on Bulbapedia on what level does uh, Toxic Batman grow, like learn a new move, and ironically, level 12. And uh, would you look at that? It finally learned Bite. Finally, another move besides Leech Life. So it's actually gonna help us out in the long run right here, and I did. Well, I did uh, grow lucky to another level, including Cinder, just in case. But you know what? Before we get into even more trouble, let's go to Cinder right here. We don't want to get into too much trouble. So here we are back, same direction, and we find ourselves a Great Ball, which is pretty cool. I mean, we already caught the Pokemon we wanted. Oh, yeah, and I also found out that you can capture Ghastly's around here, too. Completely forgot about that, too. Huh. <laughs> Completely forgot. Okay, so moving on. Do you not want to capture another Wooper right here? And this guy sees us and he's like, I found some good Pokemon in the grass. I think they'll I think they'll do for it right now. Okay. Whatever you say, Sunshine, let's go. So here we have a youngster, Gordon. Who names your kid Gordon anymore? And he comes out with a Wooper, okay. That's the only Pokemon you got. Seriously. Are you sure you want to do that? Because I got like four. I got a tank. And uh, I probably should have switched right there. Yeah, that, well, didn't take a lot. 
I can still beat it. But <laughs> that will do me damage right there. So I gotta finish this guy off real quick. And that, yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. How did I know that was gonna happen? Come on, finish him off. And there we go. Bye bye. So that's another, another, another experience for for our good good old buddy uh, Cinder and uh, Gordon. He's like, darn it! I thought I could win. No, you weren't gonna win. Not at all. Is there anything around here that I missed? No, I didn't miss anything. Not right there either. I beat everybody. Okay, all right. Yeah, okay, so got this guy right here. I don't think we're gonna battle him. He's like, how would you like to have this? A tasty, nutritious slowpoke tail. For the right for right or for you right now, just a million dollars. You want this? And I'm like, ah no. You don't want it, then scram, shoo. Yeah, screw you then. Okay, so I think that's pretty much it. I may be forgetting one more trainer. Yes, there is one more trainer right here. Let's go ahead and beat this guy. He's like, that, that badge is from Violet City. You beat Faulkner? Of course I did, man. Come on, everybody beats Faulkner. What kind of a job is that? Being a Pokemon trainer or Pokemon gym leader and just getting beaten every single time. So here we go. Coming out with the Pidgey. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's finish this guy off with a little Ember attack. Will it work? Yes, it will. Because look at that. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And more experience points. And, uh... You know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to go with Lucky right here. Let's go, Lucky. Let's do this. Be Lucky. Be a man. It's in your blood to beat this guy. And you're two levels ahead of him. So, let's go with that water gun. And, uh... Yeah, still forgot that we're a little slower than usual. There we go. No, oh, not that much. Come on. He won't let us win. Why can't you just let us win, bro? Let us win. Let my people through. Go again with the water gun and, uh... Well, we're getting tackled up the yin-yang. Luckily, we're close by to a, a Pokemon Center, but I really want to win this. Oh, I want Lucky to win this. And, uh, well, checkmate right here. We beat you, PG. We beat you. Oh, yes. Hmm, that's some good experience points. And he's going to come out with his Spearow. So that is a big no. And I'm going to go with Toxic Batman. I need to show off that new bite attack. You know, other than uh, than uh, Leech Life. Trust me, I used a lot of Leech Lives. Just to get to this level right here. So, here we go. Bite attack. Look at that. Takes more damage. This is awesome. This is great. This is freaking great. Here we go again. Bite attack. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You're not liking this. You're not liking this. Here we go. Bite attack with the critical hit. And there we go. Easy. So, that's another bird keeper defeated. He's like, I know what my weaknesses are. Yeah. Bird type Pokemon. You only have them right there. Anywho, we're going to stay right here, guys. Stay tuned. In the next episode, we will be going through uh, the U Union Cave right here. I think that's what it's called. Union Cave and then uh, heading on to Azalea Town. All that stuff. Yeah. I'll see you guys. Beep.